Yo, yo, yo! <laughs> What's happening? You alright or what? Hello there! Hello! How we doing everyone? How we doing? Uh, happy Big Wednesday! Happy Big Wednesday! Halfway there, halfway there. Happy Hump Day, depending on your preference. And, uh, hello! Hello! How are you doing? Hope everyone's just doing well. Hope everyone's doing well, having a good week. Um, we're halfway through it. Halfway through it. Um, so, uh, there's that. And, uh, I know you can make it to the finish line. I know you can make it to the finish line. Just think as well, when you get to the finish line this week, Bayonetta, Bayonetta will be out. Bayonetta will be out in two days. Uh, day after tomorrow. Super hyped for that. Super hyped for that. But, um, hi. Hi, how are we doing? Um, we are, uh, we are playing Fallout tonight. Um, as is the style, of course. And, uh, we're picking up... Ooh, bloody hell, let me tab over a minute. We're picking up, uh, right where we left off. Here in Old World Blues. Now, um, I'm not sure, I'm not sure if I'm going to need to have this on my person. Uh, to do this. Bear with me. I'm um, going to get my bearings again. Where, where's my bedroom? Here we are. Um, I think it should be in here. Right. I might need to have this on my person for, for this to work. So, um, if you remember, we picked up, uh, upgrade for the Cyberdog gun. Upgrade holotape received. Add in K9000 weapon mod Menta Chow to vendor inventory. Might I be of service, sir? Yes, please. Um, I would like uh, to buy some things. Very right, where's this, um, where's this mod? It would be a misc, I guess. There we are. Uh, that's fine. We'll buy that. And um, I've got some things that I can sell to you as well, my good man. Uh, let's sell you pre-war money. And uh, where's it gone? I swear, I had uh, I had Legion money on me. Can I not sell that? Will he not take it? My my my! I did not know that. Unless it's in another, it wouldn't be in another tab. Oh dear, oh dear. Okay, fine. Okay, this guy doesn't like to take uh, Legion money. I guess that makes sense, though, right? Because um, these are... Uh, this computer here is technically pre-war. Right, okay. That's fine. Let's take that. And then we'll upgrade it. Um, I don't think we'll be using it anyway, so this is a giant waste of money, really. Mod this with the K9000 mod Mentat Chow. Increases weapon fire rate. There we are. We'll put that on there. And, oh, okay. It still takes the same uh, ammo as well. Maybe there's more than one upgrade for this gun. But um, that spits out really precious ammo quicker. So it's even worse, technically. <laughs> All right, let's put that away. We don't need that on our person. Anyway, with that aside, uh, what we'll do as well, we'll do a, a little recap today. I wonder if I can, uh, wonder if I can make anything here. That's the wrong, uh, wrong container. Um, what am I missing? Scrap metal. We've got a lot of weapon repair kits anyway, so that's fine. Uh, what condition are our weapons in? God, that pip pimp boy. Super bright. Step over this side so it doesn't reflect the light so much. There we go. There we go. Right. Um, everything's in tip-top condition, really. Um, I was messing up a lot last week when I was talking about these sonic emitters. Um, I was talking about Gabriel's Bark. I was calling a tarantula, uh, which was incorrect. So, uh, sorry about that. And uh, let's, uh, let's have a little recap about last week. Because um, we got hold of a key for the research center. So, um, it says here, release the unusual specimen into the testing area. So, we'll be going to do that first. But um, I also made a mistake when I, mi I, I mistook the Y17 medical facility for the X8 Research Center. We went there to get the auto dock because that was really important um, to have a doctor back at the sink. Um, and I thought that we'd already been here. I was confusing it with X8. Um, so that was another mistake that I made. Uh, I don't need my marker anymore. Um, so let's remove that. Um, and then what we'll do, we'll go back to the Y17 medical facility because 
Um, now, the first time that we went there, we weren't able to break uh, force fields. So we'll go back there and we'll have a thorough look after we've been to uh, back to X8. Uh, X13, of course, was where we upgraded our sonic emitter, I believe. Um, okay. Oh, that's, uh, that's where we got the sink. That's fine. Higgs Village we know about as well. We haven't been in there, I don't think. We just passed it. So X8 is where we're going to be going back to. Uh, speaking of um, force fields, I'm breaking them as well with our sonic emitter now. You can actually break these ones on the balcony. You can get rid of them. But um, you can't throw yourself over the balcony. Game doesn't allow you to do that. But you can break them um, if you really want to. Uh, there's not much point to it, I don't think. Um, I mean, you might, might be able to use Christine's sniper rifle to see enemies out in the world. See, there's a lobotomite there. Let's see if we can pick him off at this distance. Hopefully, I'm not using good ammo here. Nope, terrible shot. Never mind. I'm not going to uh, keep trying and waste ammo. Right. Back into the sink. Um, there's another thing we might be able to do, in fact. Uh, I don't want to break down 308s. Can I create 308s? What do I need? Lead. Powder. Oh, we haven't got a, we haven't got any of those things. And I probably won't pick any up as well. Uh, maybe. Hold on. Maybe. I've got a plan. I've got some excess ammo in here, right? Nope. Um, oh. Of course. It's in the ammo box. Silly me. Right. Uh, I want 375s. I want 44s. Take the uh, 556. Um, and that'll do. Right. Now break down 556. Okay. And uh, now we can create some 308s. What are we missing? Prima large rifle. Dang it. Okay. I haven't got any of that. That's fine, though. How much did that weigh? Oh, it didn't really weigh anything, so we're good. Um, I wonder, though. No? No energy weapons? Ammo? Fine. Okay, that's fine. Maybe you do it here. Ah, here we go. Right, what do our weapons use right now? We've got energy cells and microfusion cells. Um, hmm. Have I got anything that I can break down energy, energy weapon-wise? Electron charge packs. I'll take these microfusion cells as well. Yeah. I don't know why I stored them. Right, take these electron charge packs a second. And let's see. Ah, uh, right, okay, you can only convert the same uh, type of ammo into more powerful ammo. I won't be doing that, though. That's fine. Uh, electron charge packs can go back in there. Right, okay. Let's, uh, let's get on with things, shall we? Um, out to Big Mountain. Okay. Now, uh, I can fast travel over there. Uh, all our stats are good. That's good. Um, what I really need to get as well, and I don't know where it is off, uh, from memory, I really need to get hold of uh, the sink upgrade so I can fill up empty bottles and make purified waters. Right, here we go. Hello, Roxy! <clears throat> I forgot you were still here, girl. Right. We want to be, uh, I don't know, I don't remember what this is. Because we've done, um, we've done Gabe, right? Uh, is this the right place? Is this the right computer? Local map. Alright. Allegedly, it's through here. Oh, we got the key for, oh. Oh! Okay, alright, alright. Not cool, not cool. What gun do I want? This gun will do. 
I was not expecting that. Is Roxy here? Right, screw you, Night Stalkers. Please die. Dang it. I was not expecting them to pop right out of there. Oh shit, there's more. Okay, we're in, we're in trouble already. Roxy, help me, girl. Good girl. I guess technically she wasn't my companion. Because uh, I hadn't asked her to uh, follow me. No, don't target Roxy, game. Why would you target Roxy? Target the Night Stalker. I missed. I missed again. Oh, no. Oh, no. Poor Roxy's dead. Oh, my God. It's still alive. Jesus Christ. I think my uh, suit saved my life there by injecting me with Stimpak. Oh, poor Roxy. Right, I'll take your energy cell. And I'll take your scrap metal as well, because that's the component I'm missing for uh, uh, weapon repair kits. Now, um, I'm going to have to deal with some, some heat. Jesus Christ, already? Already we're in a buttload of trouble. Um, okay. Uh, do, do, do. Uh, let's, uh, let's eat some of this thick red paste. Um, actually, I'm going to eat the thin variant. Um, also, pile on uh, whatever else we can. Uh, what, what are the healing items that we got? We'll take some maize. This maize is amazing. And I'll eat some gecko steak as well. That should be fine. And, uh, our HP should fly up at this point. But still be careful, though. There could still be more, uh, bloody night stalkers in here. What condition is my armor in? Out of curiosity. Oh, God. Right, okay. It's, uh, it's in relatively good condition at the moment. Right. Remember, these bastards can turn invisible as well, so be very, very careful. I take scrap, scrap electronics. Let me turn my light on. If you want to be sneaky, turn off your pit boy light. <laughs> uh, yeah, your uh, your suit will tell you off for having your pit boy light on when you're sneaking, which is kind of funny. I'm taking these nine millimeters as well. Ooh. Oh, this is a cup, not a coffee cup. I'm taking these uh, ammo that we don't use um, because uh, we can break them down. We can break them down. Hopefully, uh, eventually, we'll get some bits to convert into... Um... Oh, what's this? Schematics. Oh, it's just for the... Uh... It's just the other sch schematics for the uh, K9000. Uh, but yeah, we'll break them down and hopefully be able to convert them into more useful ammo uh, down the line. Right. Is that all that's here, apart from this terminal? Oh, hello. How do I get up on there? How do I get up there? Okay. Challenge accepted. Right, okay. Um, there's got to be a way, right? There's got to be an easier way. Like, how would like to get up there? Have I checked this yet? Scrap electronics? Hell yeah. Maybe if I go upstairs, there's a way. Remind me as well, because um, uh, I'll probably forget. Remind me to um, make uh, another Roxy. What number is that? That's like Roxy 4, right? I think Roxy the 4th. Uh, my healing stopped as well. Let's pop another uh, stim pack. Did I actually pop a stim pack? Oh right, I pressed the wrong button. My bad. How on earth do you get up there? That's the question. Ah! I want to get up there. I want to see uh, if there's anything good up there. Because there's a locker up there. Ah, there we go. Nice and easy. Right, give me that. Okay, take all of them. Like say, even though, aha, right. We can break. Uh, we can break down any. Uh, I want that wrench. Uh, we can break down anything that we. Um... Oh, a pre-war park stroller outfit. We won't be taking that. That's terrible. Plus one agility though. So, ooh, combat armor. Hmm, cool. 
Put on throw an axe. Where ammo have we got here? I will take the charge pack. I uh, will take the energy cells and the microfusion cells here. So we actually use that ammo. I suspect as well that um, the... Do I want to take that? That's really valuable. I'll take it. And we can repair our combat helmet with that probably. Okay. Um, is this... Uh, oh, okay. This is where we're supposed to go. Um, one second. Where's my... Oh, that really does need repair. And we get uh, extra damage threshold now for our reinforced combat helmet. Um, I'll probably end up selling this. It's worth a lot of money. Okay. Oh. Well, that doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good at all. Scrap electronics I'll take. What's with all that noise? Blimey hair. Coffee mug. Right, we're nearly awake capacity now. I'll take that to drink now, so it'll give me a little bit of healing at least. Um, so, Nuka Cola. Um, oh, I went way past it. Nuka Cola and drink it immediately. What the fuck is that noise? Right, I can't carry anything else right now. Is this supposed to be so noisy? I've been here. Consult the map a second. Right, okay, apparently it goes over this way. I have no idea why it's so noisy. Um, isn't this where we came from? Apparently it's telling me to go back here. I think maybe... Yeah, I think maybe it's something to do with the terminal. Oh, I completely missed this as well. Robot and Night Stalker splicing experiment holotape. That might actually be why we were here. Why we come here in the first place. I'm going to check the terminal anyway. Yeah, I think the quest mark is still on the terminal. Okay. Uh, oh, there we go. That's what I have to do. Um, okay. Unusual shipment. Uh, Dr. Richardson, we've re just received the latest uh, shipment of dogs for the cyber dog experiment process. But, well, frankly, I think our supply screwed us. The animals must be basically feral. Every time we get close to the shipping kennels, they let out with the most god-awful hissing and, well, rattling. It's the only way I can describe it. Please advise. Should we, be, should we open the kennels or just send them back? So... That sounds a lot more like um, Night Stalkers than, than dogs, if you ask me. Um, right, we'll then uh, release the unusual specimen. So that's what we came here to do. Right, that doesn't fill me with a lot of confidence though. Um, it actually fills me with a lot of dread. Okay. What did that say? Hold on. Activate institutional data retrieval test. Basic at the X8 terminal. Okay. Worries me that there's something. Something nasty lurking around here. Like some form of Night Stalker. Do you think that maybe it was invisible and in the kennels? Where am I going exactly? Ah! Okay, apparently we're going back through here. 
Um, yeah, it's this one, right? No, it's done that. Hmm. Activate institutional data retrieval test. Basic. Okay. Basic. Area loaded. Enter the testing area. This is where the specimen's gonna be, right? So be ready. I should have got Roxy. Attention, students. This is the pre recorded voice of your pre recorded. Oh, we gotta do this again? So retrieve all the data again. Before I do that. Don't forget, you can break these uh, force fields as well. Time to fight. Oh! Something's here. Something's here. Oh, I'm in danger! Okay, instead of cyber dogs, now there's night stalkers everywhere. I get you. Is that a complete miss? I might go back and get Roxy. <laughs> Although she will most certainly die very quickly to night stalkers. I'm in danger still. Right, I see the blips on my... Uh, on my compass. Right, okay. We're in caution. Right, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna get through the test uh, before I go collecting anything. Is that active? That's active. Uh, uh are we in slow motion? Okay. Uh, here we go. This should be the first one. How many times have we got? To, this better be the last time we've got to do this. Retrieve student records. Here we go. Records acquired, nice. Aha. Hello. Go down. He did some flippy dips. Okay, I'm still in danger. I think it's a turret. I think there's a turret in this, uh... Yeah, there we go. Oh, he spotted me. It's fine now. What's with the slow mo? Is my is my suit in injecting me with more drugs Steady. or something? Steady. Better not be. Okay, they're through here. Was that all? I think they're over the other side of that thing. I'm too far away. No, that's just uh, lockers and things. Do I see something there? No, that's just a chair. Oh, they must be on the floor above me. Okay, I got you. I'd love to pick up more scrap electronics, but I'm full on weight at the minute. Shit! Why can't I target his head? There we go. Kill it! Kill it quick! God, they're terrifying. God, they're absolutely terrifying. That's why I know it's dead, man. Okay. Alright. Cool. I think the rest of them are upstairs. It's probably going to spawn in more when I get the last uh, record as well. No way! Oh, fuck! Oh my god, there's two. There's two. Right, back up, back up. Do some vats. Oh, I'm stuck. Screw you. That's one of them down. Oh god, this one's actually got a lot of health left. Vats, quickly. I can't... can't get a hit in that. Right. Please finish it off, otherwise he's gonna finish me off. <laughs> he got skied. Alright, cool. Oh, we're still in danger. Right, I better do some healing. I better do some healing. 
Um, stim pack. Uh, we'll go for some more red paste as well. Uh, we'll go for the thick variant this time though. And I'll drink some water. Eat some maize because ma maize is amazing. And my last gecko steak as well. And a fresh apple. Get everything on. Get everything we can on. Apart from Brahmin steak. Brahmin steak are really useful for strength, uh, strength, bu strength buff. Where the fuck is it? I'm pretty sure, now, I've said this every time, but I'm pretty sure that that one is upstairs. But he might be able to get down here. So, let's be careful. I'm in caution now, anyway. Bloody hell, these things are horrible. Uh, also, where's the um, computer terminal? So there's one down here. I think I might get the one upstairs first. Because, like I said, I've got a horrible feeling I'll sp spawn in more enemies as soon as I grab the last one. Actually, no. I'm going to get this one first because I think the exit is right next to uh, the one upstairs. Oh, wow. There's loads of... Uh... Purified water. Hell yeah. Uh, and we'll take that as well, of course. Still in caution. Take that right away. And that med -X Because my suit keeps pumping me full of med -X at this point. Um, right. So I may as well keep up my supplies. Where's this other... I bet no one has ever been as unnoticed as me. Quiet suit. Where is it? Maybe they're both upstairs. Apparently it's around this corner. Hmm. Yeah, maybe they're both upstairs. Okay, let's go upstairs. It's neither of those. They're both fake by the looks of things. Or broken, I should say. Make sure we're fully loaded. It's going to be Night Stalkers up here. Oh, where did that come from? Take all them. I'm going to drink them right away, actually. Uh, where are we at? Sunset Sasperada. Give me a Star Bottle Cap. No? Shame. I still haven't uh, I still haven't done the bottle cap uh, quest. So uh, I'm going to keep drinking sus Sunset Sarsaparilla whenever I find them. Oh, hello. Right, you're going to be active. Okay, now we're in court. What's with the slow-mo, dude? Every time. There's the Night Stalker. Hopefully the last one. I'll take the manual over the 50-50 in this instance. Uh, oh, God. I changed that. I didn't mean to change ammo. Bloody hell. Right, this better be the last one. And off in space he goes. Okay, this is one of the terminals. <coughs> Records acquired. Nice. Right, and then the last one is over here. No more enemies either. Just in case, though. Going to sneak. Oh, shit! Alright. There's two of them. That's never good. Um, I don't know what that uh, achievement was I just picked up, but... Oh god. Oh, alright, that worked out pretty well. Pretty well. Uh, it's usually... They've moved it. 
Where on earth is this last one? Is it in there? Allegedly. Is that it? That can't be it. That's the turret control. Yeah, that's the turret system. Apparently it's... Oh, God. Wibbly vision. Um, okay, I'm kind of confused. It must be below me, then. Because um, it's where I'm standing, allegedly. So it must be downstairs. Oh, it was in here. I walked straight past it. What an idiot I am. There we go. Uh, exit the testing area. I can do that. Is it upstairs? No. That I can do. I don't think anything spawned in either. That's nice. Boys and girls take their medics. Stop! Oh, oh, there's enemies. Stop injecting me with medics, please, fight. Sue. I don't want to get addicted. Where did those blips go? Are they upstairs? Over. They must be upstairs. I didn't close the doors, though. They can follow me. Oh, hello. I think I need to go up to exit. Uh, one second though. I've got um, carry weight now. So let's take all of these. Scotch. I don't want scotch. Um, let's check this footlocker. I'll take them. Why not? Mm, I can do without the Nuka-Cola for now. There we go. Now we're at weight capacity. Okay. Let's go upstairs then. Yeah. Let's go upstairs and get out of this horrendous place. I'm running out of ammo for this gun, I've just noticed. That's not good. That is definitely not good. I'm going to not change ammo. I'm going to switch over to Christine's gun. And uh, we'll, try and, uh, we'll try and stay in stealth and take out any Night Stalkers before they notice where I am. Time to fight. Oh, here we go. They, they know about me already, somehow. Are we being watched? Stop it, suit. Last time you talked like that, you started creeping me out. Was that all? Okay, apparently... Apparently, they just disappeared. <laughs> I ain't gonna complain. I'm not complaining about that at all. Bloody Night Stalkers are a nightmare. They're not the worst thing in the world, but they're horrible all the same. Now, I saw red on my compass. Ah! Hello there. Uh, how did you miss? How did you miss it? Oh my god. Okay, alright, alright. This is happening now. I don't have the ammo to be wasting like this. Please hit this time. Oh my god, come on, what's wrong with you? Right, forget about them. Let's just run for it. Bloody hell. That went super bad. Right, okay. Activate institutional data retrieval. Test of... Oh, i got to go through again. Okay. Okay, we have to go through it again. I'll take that. What's my carry weight? Exactly. 
Uh, I haven't got the carry weight for them. I'll take them, though. Yeah, I haven't got the carry weight. That's fine. Right, I'm going to make Roxy this time as well. Um, because uh, that would be helpful. That would be very helpful. Uh, how do I get out of here? Am I heading the right way here? I hope so. So I get what's going on now. We just got to do the same tests again. So basic and advanced. But this time uh, with uh, the Night Stalkers. Instead of uh, Cyber Dogs. Okay. Right. Let's go and make ourselves uh, a little Roxy. Roxy the fourth. Roxy the third's body has disappeared. Oh bloody hell. Suit keeps injecting me with drugs. Stop doing that. Venture, it's only a matter of time before I get addicted. It's a shame you couldn't get armor repair kits in this game as well. Right, first things first. Um, clear splicing area. We're going to make... Uh, we got a new thing to make, so we'll do that first. Uh, I hope I've got enough, um, enough uses today. Because you can only do three things per... Uh, you can only do three things per day. So let's splice. Uh, that's the new one, right? Um, robot and unusual specimen. Oh, it's 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 aggressive. It's violent. Oh, exploded. Oh, okay. So this apparently is what you get when you splice a robot with a Night Stalker. Um, you get a very, very violent but temporary Robo Brain. Now, let's clear that up. Clear splicing area. And uh, let's get ourselves a Roxy for this next test. Uh, splice, robot, and dog. Yeah, you can only do this three times per in-game day. I'm pretty sure this is Roxy 4. I think we're on number 4. Hey, Roxy. Hi there, puppy. I'm sure you won't die like your predecessors. Come with me, girl. Right, let's go. I really need your help, girl. I'm running seriously low on uh, on ammunition here. <clears throat> All right, back to the testing area then. The thing is, the more I fight, um, the less ammo I have. And the less ammo I have, the more carry weight I have spare. Right, well, what are we doing now? We're doing advanced, right? Let's just double check. Activate institutional data retrieval test advanced. <clears throat> Play advanced test. Okay. Alright, let's be a lot more careful about it about it this time. Right, I'm gonna go over to not ammo game. Crystals. Okay. Let's do this nice and sneaky like this time. No more medicine. Ah, you st stupid suit! You've become addicted to a drug. Take more of the drug to alleviate the side effects or visit a doctor to be cured. God damn it. I knew it was going to happen eventually. Right. Christine's rifle isn't as good against those uh, turrets either. It'll be better... Uh, hang on. Hollow point. Here we go. This will be really good against... Uh, Ready. Stay. Against Night Stalkers. Because they're creatures, they don't have much in the way of damage threshold, so hollow point will put these down nicely. Unless, of course, you miss. Oh, shit. Roxy! Thank you, girl. Good girl. Right. 
In theory, they do, anyway. In theory, they do. Right. Oh. Right, take the manual shot. Nice. That can't be trusted. Right, don't have much hollow point left, though. There go, there's one of them. I did take that, right? Yeah. Okay. Starting combat. What do you mean Just start? Time. What do you mean starting combat? We're hidden right now. That's all. Right, they're probably probably one in here, right? Like last time. Oh god damn. It. Pardon me. Sneaky motherfucker. Right, down to my last five hollow point rounds now. You are in the library. Be quiet here and fill with <laughs> Dr. Boris is quite funny. Right, you. I didn't realize there's gonna be protectrons here as well. Oh! God damn night stalkers! Go away! <laughs> Leave me alone! Oh my goodness. Oh. There's something else. There's something else. There's something else here. I'm in danger. Oh, where's Roxy? I hope Roxy's okay. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. I know what it is. I know what it is. It's a uh, gun turret. Bloody hell. Right, we're in caution. Caution's better than danger. I'm okay with caution. Right, here's another one. Then the last one's upstairs, of course. That goes acquired. Let's get ourselves upstairs now. Something's got us in caution. Bloody night stalkers. They're terrifying. Do I really want... Should I go over to overcharge? I've only got two of them, so no. I think Roxy's dead as well. I think that Roxy might be dead. Unfortunately. She didn't uh, fear as well as... Uh, well, actually... She Probably feared about the same. They all they all died, right? I probably shouldn't have made another one until I left. Because uh, hopefully I can make another one before I go. Hopefully. Before I'm done with this place. What was that? Oh, Roxy! Speaking of, girl. I'll take your energy cell. Ready, steady. Why, why the slow mo game? Right, I see you. Over to Christine's. I'm gonna take the manual. Oh, Back you see me? Has he seen me? Can I shoot him through here? Should be able to, right? Okay, that's probably an after effect of being addicted to Medex. Because of my stupid suit. Keeps injecting me. I can get rid of the addiction though with the auto dock, so that's uh that's a one reason why it's good to pick that up. As soon as possible. Really. Right. If uh last time was anything to go by, there'll be two in here. I don't see red on my compass right now though. Oh shit. I hope it doesn't hurt too bad. We don't have any medics. Good! You can stop injecting me now. How did you miss? Time to fight. How did you miss? Cool.
Oof, right. That should be that. It's probably I bet you it spawns in more uh, more enemies. What should spawn in more? Yep. Fantastic. Fuck you! Uh -oh. oh god. Oh, it crippled my leg! Shit. Oh, how do you- how do you miss? Seriously. I need to- I need to heal! I need to heal. Right. Um, first things first. Sort out that limb. Uh, use some stim pack. I really gotta get, like, thin red paste. Um, super stim pack, that'll do. Um, oh god, right. Drink some water. Uh, eat some maize. Maize is amazing. Uh, fresh apple. Get everything stacking on each other, because I'm, I'm going to die otherwise. Uh, which one did we eat? Did we eat thick? Right, that'll do. That should be fine. Now I've got to put this thing down, like, before it kills me. Oh god. Oh. oh! Thank goodness for that. Jesus Christ. Right, let's, in, uh, let's just uh, pop another stim pack real quick. And, uh. How is my armor looking? Oof. My armor's taking a beating. I'm gonna have to pay to get that repaired. Jairo Zappelli, what's up, dude? Uh, Giga Chad beard cut, looking good. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Happy big Wednesday to you, Zappelli. How you doing, buddy? I, I, it feels like it's been a long while since I spoke to you. Happy big Wednesday. Hope you're uh, doing well. Hope you're having a good week. And uh, thanks for coming along, buddy. Thanks for coming along. Right, let's get the flip out of this cursed place as well. Before uh, I get any more knackered by bloody Night Stalkers. And uh, I need to get rid of this addiction as well. This stupid suit has got me hooked on Medex. Here we are. Exit time. Um, oh, don't tell me I've got to go through another one. Treat test data from the X8 test terminal. Oh, right. Uh, and usual speci specimen test results. Ooh, 400 XP. Nice. Uh, DNA agent pu uh, perk granted. Your study of the uh, abominations created in Big Mountain is granted you damage bonus plus 10 against Night Stalkers. Nice. You get 10% extra damage on Night Stalkers. That's worth it, actually. That is very much worth it. My uh, my gun's knackered as well, but I've got plenty of uh, weapon repair kits back at home. Uh, Zapelli, I'm doing great. Been really busy with studies lately. Fair enough, dude. Fair enough. Uh, but um, that's good. That's good to be bu busy studying. You know, it, you put in uh, put in that work studying, and it'll. Uh, what's the saying? This I had something for this. You reap what you sow. That's what I'm looking for. All right. So if we work hard now, it'll pay off, buddy. So it'll be worth it. It'll be worth it. What are you studying again? I'm sorry if you've told me in the past. But uh, I can't remember. I can't remember if you have told me. Um, right, before we go, um, let's, make, let's make another Roxy. Uh, splice, robot, and dog. There we go. Uh, business computing, mainly IT stuff. Awesome, dude. Awesome. You can only be able to do some really cool stuff with that as well. And here we are, here's Roxy. Right. Follow me, girl. She can't leave the facility, but we want her to be here alive because she gets uh, she gets an ending slide for the DLC. So we wanna we wanna keep uh, um, we wanna have a Roxy uh, before we leave. And you can only splice three three things per in-game day as well. But uh, we want before we leave this area for good. 
We want to make sure that uh, we have created ourselves a Roxy. Right, now I'm going to have to go straight back to the sink now. Two reasons. One, sort out my carry weight situation. God damn, that's, that's bright. This pit, oh, I, there's nothing I can do about it, apparently. It's very bright on both sides that uh, I face. Right, think tank. Uh, so yeah, one reason is my carry weight. Two reason to get rid of this bloody addiction as well. And this stupid suit. I might have to pay for it to be repaired as well. Maybe. Um, right, auto dock, my main man. You require some additional services? I do. Um, I'd like your services, please. And rightly so, I should think. All right. Um. Can it actually get rid of my addiction? This prototype auto dock is capable of performing a thorough physical exam, uh, curing the patient of all common alignments, radiation sickness, lacerations, broken bones, even chemical addictions. Ah, there we go. Basic physical exam. That should do it, right? Am I addicted? I'm now completely healthy. Okay. Effects. Okay, I think, I think that's cured me of my addiction. And all my limbs have fallen again now as well, which is good. I certainly hope it's cured me anyway. Um, another thing I need to do. Have I got Elijah's gun on right now? I do. Okay. Another thing I need to do is uh, weapon repair kits. Um, in fact, do you know what? Take all of that. I might be able to make some more now with some of the stuff I picked up. Oh, I can only make one. Alright, never mind. Um, <clears throat> yeah, let's, uh, let's repair Elijah's gun, because Elijah's gun, it doesn't half, uh, get damaged quickly. Now, um, your weapon condition will, uh, deteriorate ra more rapidly, uh, from using it in VATS. Um, but this thing, this thing's almost, uh, busted up already, so. Good thing we made a bunch of these, right? How's that looking? One more should do it. Weapon repair kits are a function of your actual repair skill as well. So the higher your repair skill, the um, more beneficial uh, uh, it'll be um, when you use uh, a repair, uh, a repair, uh, a re weapon repair kit. Sorry. Right. Um, let's put away all of my bits for um, for making. There we go. Scrap electronics. Wonder glue. And range. Is that all I had left? What else goes in? Just scrap metal, right? Yeah, just scrap metal, I believe. Now, um, I will pick up the other uh, mod for... Uh, I Hang on, how much is it going to cost me to repair my armor? Where is my armor? Not bad. Oh, flip. I can't even afford it. That's not good. We might have to... Um, I might have to actually wear this combat armor. I might have to swip, swap over this. I should have kept my other combat armor. I sold it to the sink, though, didn't I? Might I be of service, sir? Um, I'd like to buy some things. Um, I may as well, while I'm here... Uh, where are we? I picked up schematics for the um, dog gun, right? Uh, apparently, you don't buy it from here anyway. Um, I can make some money. Let's sell some of these cigarettes and make money. And sell that pre-war money as well. Yeah, there's the reinforced... That's going to cost me all of my caps to buy back. Shit, okay. I might have to switch over to this combat armor. Um, my plan was to sell it. But I might have to switch over... Oh, that's really annoying. If I buy back my reinforced stuff, that's most of my money gone. But that's better as well. Flip. Um... Hmm. 
I don't think there's anything I can use to repair mine myself. Which is unfortunate. Um, I think... I think I'm going to buy back my own armor. Um, that leaves me super broke though, unfortunately. But uh, I'm going to have to. I'm going to use the combat armor I picked up to repair it as well. Um, what have I sold to you so far? It's a shame you won't take Legion money. But that does make sense. That makes perfect sense. Bloody hell. Sell you a couple of these anyway to make some money. Uh, no, actually keep them. Keep them. Okay, fine. I got 293 caps to my name. Right, equip that. I'm going to get rid of this style suit. I'm going to put it away. I'll miss you. Oh, <laughs> I'm not going to miss you, stealth suit. You're a pain in the bloody ass. Um, right. Stealth suit. Piss off. Go away. I never want to see you ever again. Um, <laughs> I mean that as well. It's a nightmare. Okay. I forgot to put away as well. Um, bloody hell, that spooked me. I forgot to put away my actual weapon repair kits. Uh, aid, right? Uh, there we go. I'll put all of them away. Um, I got a few things to uh, store that I was picking up for later as well. I think I've put them in here. Yeah, here we are. Um, so I've picked up a couple more coffee cups as well. Uh, let's put them away for now. There will be a reason for picking them up, uh, which uh, I'll show uh, later on when we get the uh, right thing that we need. Right, and we've we got less uh, to carry around as well now. We've got more carry uh, carry weight available to us. Um, oh, ammo. Before I forget. Let's break down uh, the ammo we don't want to use. So break down the 10 millimeter. And we'll break down this as well. Uh, break down the 12 gauge. Break down... Did I just make them? I didn't mean to make them. Flip. I was supposed to be breaking them down. Flip. Okay. I was in the wrong menu. Right. Break them down. This That, that was just pointless. Right. Break down... 5.56. Five, break down... The 9mm. Now, can I create... 308s? I still probably need, yeah, I still need a uh, large rifle prima. Dang. Okay, never mind. All right, I can put some uh, stuff away, I think. Ammo. Yeah, put all that away. I might need to, um, I might need to fall back onto the uh, Fido gun um, at some point as well. Because um, all of my guns are running out of ammo. Like, really badly. So, um, I might not have any choice but to use the... Uh, to use the... Uh, the... The, uh, the doggo gun. Right. Ne question is, as well, what are we going to do next? Because uh, that's our quest completed completely. Uh, we can get the transmitter antenna array. Or we could go and find some more of the... Uh, the personalities for the sink. Um, we've got... One more up there um, for this quest. I think he gives you a part two and tells you where the rest are. Um, the other thing we could do, um, which I was planning on doing really, was uh, going exploring more in the Y17 medical facility. That might be worthwhile. Um, what have we got left on uh, all my friends have off switches? Uh, sync, which we got. Auto dock, we got. Biological research station. Okay. Plus, we haven't uh, we haven't actually discovered this uh, location as well. I tell you what, we'll keep it simple and we'll go to uh, the Y17 for now. 
Let's start. Let's go over there. How uh, how are my guns looking? Uh, that's fine. That's now fine. Remember, we can use this as well. I hotkey that. Let's put that down here. Um, they're fine as well. Put that over there. Okay. Um, let's uh, let's go to uh, Y seventeen then. And we'll uh, we'll have more of a look around in the Y seventeen. Probably going to go right into trouble. No, we're okay for now. There's something over there. But uh, it's all good. Right. Remember, this is where we got the auto dock from. This room, at least, is going to be clear anyway. Or not. Or not. Shit, they're back. At least Mr. Orderly is back. And they explode. I see another one. I think there's only two in here, though. In total. Did he go down? I think he went down. Nope, he didn't. Oh, shit, they got plasma. They got plasma weaponry. Ah, bloody hell. Yeah, screw you. And there's where we couldn't get in last time. This uh, force field here. So now we can get through this. Um, they're kennels. Kennels unnerve me greatly. Sterilizer gloves. That's new. We've seen scientist gloves. We haven't seen sterilizer gloves. Oh, ammo. Oh, they're drained. How do I uh how do I convert drained ammo into ammo? Cuz uh that would be really useful right now. It would be really really useful. Take that coffee cup. Coffee mug I should say. Right, what have we got here? Not opening them. It could be invisible nasties in there. Ah, what's this? Patient log. Okay. I assume that's for the autodoc. I assume. Good thing we came here first as well, because it doesn't look like um, there's much else to do in here. I've got a horrible feeling, though, that the game might have spawned in some enemies. <clears throat> and you know what? I kind of miss... Well, I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to say that I miss the stealth suit because I don't. The stealth su suit is a jerk. But I, what I do kind of miss is her telling me when there's going to be danger. But don't tell the stealth suit that, okay? Stealth suit is a pain in the butt. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I think we're done here. I think we're done here. Let me just uh, consult the map real quick. Yeah, that's everything. I don't think I've missed anything in here. I could probably get up and walk around now as well. I think it's safe to do so. Let's have another quick uh, scout around here. Uh, just in case. I mean, there's nothing else to do, right? No, we're good. Okay, fantastic. Let's be on our way then. Cool. What we'll do uh, next, we'll go and do. Um, okay, cool. Can I fast travel or is there enemies too close? Because we'll go there from. I guess your little Yangtze will be. Ah, there's, too, there's enemies too close. Okay. I guess Lil Yangtze will be the best place to travel there from. Be the closest place. Right, if I head over in this direction. Oh, there's enemies in every direction. Okay. I just need to get far enough away from them, though. 
Oh, I tell you what I could do. Ah, Robo Brain. How about you? Looks like that's the uh that's the border there. Oh fuck. So um remember we got told not to walk past these borders because we'll get teleported away if uh, it's kind of like the end of the world um you know when it says uh you can't go this way because there's a, an invisible wall well if you walk past these uh these these uh, antenna looking things this is what the uh think tank explained to us a couple of parts ago it will uh, teleport you straight back here so that's good that's a good thing and uh, i'm going to make use of that um another at least another time, uh, because you do get you do get an achievement for, for doing that. If I teleport now to uh, Little Yangtze, and then we'll make our way over to here from there. That's probably the best place to, to head there from. Okay. Right, let's head in this direction. Hopefully this... Because uh, last time we, w we went to um, the place where the... Uh, the sink personality was. It was real close to the forbidden zone. And hopefully I don't have to go near the forbidden zo zone again. Hopefully. What have we got here? Scrap metal I'll take. That's the thing I'm always low on for weapon repair kits. So I'll definitely take that. Okay, cool. Right over in this direction. Uh, hopefully I can go across these pipes as well. That seems like a smart thing to do. Be careful of mines. I can already see one, in fact. They do put mines on these, uh, on these pipes. They're wise to uh, your plan going across these pipes. I'll take scrap electronics and a wrench. And more scrap electronics and scrap metal and some wonder glue. That's, um, that's a re weapon repair kit right there. That's enough components. Something's up here. Something's lurking up here. Be very careful. What we got? What we got around this corner? What we got exactly? X-17 Meteorological Station. Okay. Is that our destination? No. Not quite. There is something nasty around this corner. I can hear something coming. Oh shit, it's right there. It's a sentry bot by the looks of things. Oh, weird. Okay. It tried to get through the wall and it couldn't quite make it. Right, I don't think... Unless I can get up here. Maybe I can Skyrim my way up. There we go. Nice. How did that sentry bot get through that wall? Oh, I'm in caution. Oh, I'm in danger. Right, what's got me in danger? Probably this thing. The sentry bot. Where is he? Can't... Oh, th God, he's right there. Oh, this gun just... This gun just tears through him, though. That's a Mark IV uh, sentry bot as well. Do you know what, as well? I think this combat armor is, got, is just better in general. I didn't take much damage at all from that sentry bot in that instance. I should never have sold it. I, it was really bad. Um, I was a really bad investment, that was. I was like, oh yeah, this is, I'll sell this and make a load of money. But he would, the sink wouldn't have bought it at true value. Um, what the prices are, um, what the prices the vendors will buy things from uh, you are a function of your barter skill. And I never bother with barter. It's, uh, it's a few barter checks throughout the... Uh, Throughout the base game, um, but I never bother with it. You can uh, you can do without barter, 
So he wouldn't have bought that at true value. However, he would have sold it to me, sold it back to me a much closer to, uh, what the fuck? What the hell? What the hell's hitting me? Oh, it's right there. Um, that was not doing a lot of damage to it. Right, let's take you. A uh, spore plant. Yeah, interestingly, spore plants live in um, in Big Mountain, and uh, I'll go into that a bit more momentarily. But uh, anyway, back to that combat armor. He would have bought it off me for less than he sold it f to me, um, from a lot less as well. Oh, that's Patient Zero. Okay, that's a unique uh, spore creature. Um, if you recall, um, we fought these back in Vault 22. Um, that was the that was the vault where uh, I'm still in danger. Right, he doesn't have anything on him. That was the vault where we had all the spore cre these spore creatures because the technology there. Um, they tried to um, they tried to. Uh, basically recreate plant life and and grow uh and grow plant life but it went a bit out of control and um it infected everyone in vault 22 and turned them into spore creatures um apart from a select few uh traveled on to zion but we'll get into that someday maybe uh if we play uh, honest hearts but um yeah basically uh the technology developed for vault 22 was developed here and that was Patient Zero. That was the very first spore creature. Right, duffel bag. And uh, we did play through that as well when we were playing through um, when we were playing through the base game. Ooh. Ooh, nice. There were some goodies in there. Uh, I can cook there allegedly. Ah, Sync Project Biological Research Station. That's what we came here for. Brilliant. Fantastic. Let me take some of that as well. Let me just have a, a quick gander upstairs because I don't know if there's anything else uh, of note or use here. I can't remember off the top of my head. But there might be something. I think, in fact, that that might be something there. It might be something worth picking up while we're here. Yes, it is. Um, we've got seed package. Very important as well. We want to pick that up as well. So, uh, we've got a new... Alright, Dr. Klein, I'll uh, get to it. Don't worry about that, my uh, my friend. Right, so yeah, um, we've got another personality to plug in in the sink now, which is great. Um, quite a useful one as well. And what I really need desperately, I really desperately need to find the sink upgrade. Um, I don't recall where that is, though. I can't remember where it is, really. Um, we've... Um, uh, our quest is updated as well. Find the missing modules for the light switches and the jukebox. Okay. Um, apparently there's one over here. So we'll go, and, we'll go and get that now. Can I drop down here safely? Will I be... I uh, won't break my legs falling down here now. Good. Okay. Here we are. And uh, that should be fine as well. Excellent. Okay, I'm curious as to what's going to be in these crates. Plasma grenades. Nice. And uh, what else we got around here? Okay, I'll take that. Like I said, I... Who said that? <laughs> Colleen! <laughs> hey, Colleen. Oh, um, my feed's uh, my feed's actually frozen. Sorry, let's find out who did that. Oh, it was you, Colleen. <laughs> it was you who redeemed that. Yeah, my gameplay uh, to the side of me is actually frozen. The um, the chat's still working though, and that's the most important thing. How are you doing, Colleen? Thanks for popping along and uh, uh, and saying hi, and thank you for the lurk. Hope you're uh, having a good week, Colleen. Happy big Wednesday. Or Big Hump Day, depending on your preference. Let's get you a shout out real quick. Rezzy again? Oh, oh, oh Jesus, stop it. <laughs> nope. 
Nope. Nope. Nope. Nope. Salmon! Wow, are we having a party? I think we're having a party. <laughs> Mecca, my boy. Been a min. How are you doing? It, it has been a minute. Yeah. You're right, Salmon. How are you, my buddy? It's good to see you. Happy Big Wednesday to you, friend. Let's get you a shout out as well, my friend. Cult of the Lamb, huh? I still yet to play this. A friend of mine of Physios, one of our homies, IRL, he uh, got a little bit obsessed with that game. It's totally his uh, his type of game, though. He loves uh, the uh, Devolver Digital games. Great, I went on a va vacay. Nice, where'd you go, Salmon? Do you enjoy yourself? You deserved a vacation, buddy, to be fair. You deserved one. <laughs> oh, pardon me. Wow. Sorry about that. Burpy baby. Burpy baby. Uh, <laughs> Hope you went somewhere real nice and enjoyed yourself, Salmon. Thanks for coming along, everyone. And happy Big Wednesday, everyone. Hope, uh, hope you're having a great week so far. So far, so good, as they say. Right. Um, I've lost my bearings slightly. Where are we going? This way. Okay. I kind of, I kind of want to stay away from uh, this area with the red crystals because we're we're in forbidden zone territory here, which means robo scorpions and all sorts of nasty stuff. I mean, um, the spore carriers that we just passed. That was a good one. Fair play, Mobius. That was a good one. Um, yeah, we just come across the worst um, spore carrier. He's one of the nastiest things around here. But it's pretty cool, though, that, like, even um, the DLCs kind of link back to the main game as well. Like, we just saw um, the original spore carrier from Vault 22, essentially, because... Uh, the technology there was developed here, which is uh, interesting. As well as the Cazadors and the Night Stalkers being developed here as well. Excuse you! I know, I know, I, I, I'm sorry, Colleen, I am sorry. Salmon, uh, went up to Minnesota for a friend's wedding. Very lovely time. Oh, wow, that sounds really nice, actually. That sounds really, really nice. And c congratulations to your friends as well. Oh, do you know what? I, my ammo situation for this gun, anyway, is really, really dire now. Um, I'm down to 15 microfusion cells now, which is not good. And uh, I really don't want to run into any... There we are. Is this uh, X42? That is... Is that Mobius' base? Oh! 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 Okay, I got too close. I got too close. I got too close. Run away. Run away from the run away from the Robo Scorpions. I do not have the ammo. I tell you what, hang on. Uh this pimp boy is really, really bright. I do apologize. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna turn melee. Let's go melee. Screw you, Scorpion. Eat shit. That actually was that actually worked surprisingly well. Remember to back up, though, because they do explode. Oh, God. They, they're shooting at me. They're shooting at me from range. Run away. Run away bravely. Right, use the terrain as well. Use the terrain to confuse them. Come on, you bastards. Come at me. Oh, oh that's, a, that's a big boy. There's a big boy by there. Right, I'm going to have to... Oh, hello. Screw you. Am I too far away? I'm too far away. Um, I might want to do some healing as well. Fuck you, Scorpion. Right, there's one down. Right, let's do some, uh, let's do some healing real, real quick. Um, what else have we got? I think I'm running out of a lot of my food. Um, yeah, we run out of gecko steaks already. Eating fresh apple. Uh, maize as well. I'm nearly out of that, unfortunately. Maize is amazing. Uh, uh, we'll use 
use the super stim pack as well. I see you. <laughs> oh! Alright, I got his attention. Right, run. Keep jumping and zigzagging. Screw you! you stupid scorpion. Fuck you, buddy. Eat shit. This pro axe is really doing uh, good work. Fuck you. Right. All your friends are dead, mate. Just you and me now. Huh? What's in Versal Sacri uh, Scarifier? Let's try that. What is that even? Oh, wow. Okay, it gets special moves in Vats. I did not know that. Nice. Alright, back up. Um, apparently in caution now. Right, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna try and find a different way, I think. Or maybe. Let's consult the map a second. Maybe I make my way over there from here. Maybe that'll be safer. Right, I'm gonna teleport here. Oh, my, uh, my chat is completely crashed now. Hold on, guys. Let me sort, uh, let me sort the chat out again. My uh, my Twitch app on the side is uh, completely broken. Oh no, it's back. As a matter of fact, it's back. It's just the chat reset. I'm up to uh, I'm up to date though with the chat. So uh, oh god. Oh god, there's stuff everywhere. Okay, All right. This is the way we want to go though. There's a lot of red on my compass right now though. Are these duffel bags? Last uh, last one of these I found had really good stuff in it. I'll take them. Mm, not so good that time. That's fine. Okay, whatever. Right, this is the way we want to be going to our next destination. <clears throat> um, what upgrades were we looking for? Uh, not the sink. The sink is the one I need the most. With the sink upgrade, I can make my own purified water. Right, what are in these? Uh, anything good in here? I'll take them. Oh, there's a red flag here. We know that Ulysses paints red for danger. Oh god, there's Robo Scorpions. It's okay. I managed to do take them out pretty well with. Uh, the uh, the axe. Last time I come across these guys, so that missed. That didn't. Right, let's go, scorpions. Screw you. Just bop and weave, bop and weave. <laughs> this axe works surprisingly well against robots. Not gonna lie. I'm, uh, I'm kind of glad that I have it. Ooh, a stealth boy. Nice. I'll take that. Right, here we are. Okay, I'm in caution again. That probably means more bloody scorpions. Oops. Don't put the axe away. Thank you. Right. We seem to be alright. Okay, this is the other... St oh! Okay, so this is the other side of X-42. I think that's where Mobius is, you know. I think we're really close to uh, the Forbidden Zone right now. Big Mountain North Tunnel. Right, okay. So this, um, if you remember, the Think Tank told, uh, told us about Father Elijah ramming these uh, trains uh, into the tunnel to escape. I think this might be there, because they, they've resealed it now. But I think this is, um, this is his doing. Yeah, it's been resealed now. I think that's how Father Elijah escaped. Right, where are we, uh, where are we at? Apparently it's here, though. Apparently. Do you think it might be in... Big Mountain North Tunnel? Yeah. There's... Right, I think I might, I think I might know how we open this. But uh, I might have to go and do something and come back. 
unless. Ah, right. The entrance should be somewhere. Ah, okay. Maybe, maybe up there. If I can't get in there, we'll go in. Uh, we'll go somewhere else. But according to the map, there is an en there is somewhere I can enter. I might need to get topside though. Mysterious cave. Okay. Oh, hello. All right. Let's uh, let's poke our head in here. See what we got. Oh, I think I know. I think I know what's in here. Oh God. Yeah, I know what's in here. I definitely know what's in here. And uh, if I'm right, I do not want to stay here. <laughs> I do not want to stay here. Oh, there he is. Okay. Well, uh, get a VATS lock on him just so I can show you what he is. But we do not want to hang about here because this thing will utterly destroy us. There he is. Oh, he's just a regular bo bloat fly. Okay, cool. It's not what I was uh, thinking. We'll take him down. Okay. Uh, right. Let's keep on keeping on a second. There's something down here as well. This might be what I'm so afraid of. Around this corner. Alright, be very careful. Uh, can I get back up here if I drop down? I think so. Oh! Oh, it's just another regular. Okay, that's fine. I'll take him down. Um, I do not have much ammo left. Is that all it was? Oh, apparently this is um, where I'm supposed to be going. Take that. See my uh, my quest marker is. Oh, there he is. There he is. Okay, that's um, as you can see there, that's a legendary variant of the bloatfly. Um. Legendary enemies in uh, Fallout New Vegas, um, they operate differently to Fallout 4. In Fallout 4, um, obviously, they're plentiful uh, legendary enemies. They just got a little star next to their name. And what that means is that when you kill them, you'll get um, a legendary piece of uh, equipment, either a weapon or, or a piece of armor. In Fallout New Vegas, they were, um, they were boss enemies. And they were extra tough, extra, extra, extra tough variants of um pardon me uh they were extra extra tough variants of enemies in uh in uh fallout new vegas now this thing is going to utterly destroy me so i'm going to back away um let me consult the map because no i don't need to be here i didn't think so um this is just uh if you want to have bragging rights and come here and kill the legendary bloat fly because uh, there's no legendary uh bloat fly variant in the base game they put him here in Big Mountain. Um, he, um, instead of firing maggots like um, bloat, fl bloat flies do, he's got a projectile. Uh, he's got a, a plasma projectile. And he is tough. He's a tough guy. So uh, we're not going to uh, we're not gonna bother uh, fighting him. Not just yet, anyway. Maybe I'll come back later on when I've got some uh, more ammo and, and really uh, strong gear. Maybe then uh, we'll come back and, uh, and face that legendary bloat fly, but not right now. No chance. Two right. plus two equals I need to get up there somehow. I think I need to get up there. Hold on. Can I uh, just fast travel here? Enemies are nearby. Okay. Is there a way up there? Maybe there's a way up there. Um, also, I'm going to go over to my axe, just in case uh, this scorpion's nearby. There is, uh, oh, there they are. Or are they dead? Nope, one of them's alive. Right, let's get the sneak attack on him. So he's still hidden. Cool. 
<laughs> that was sweet. Oh, he's gonna blow. Ow. Uh, sneak attacks with melee in this game are very, very powerful as well. They needed to make up a way for um, melee uh, against range. So it, melee sneak attacks in this game in vats, in vats, they're like they're like double the damage or something. They're really, really powerful. Oh, hello. Right, let's go over to Christine's a minute. Yeah, I thought I saw a lobotomite up there. That's the location I haven't found yet as well. Might pop over there in a second. I want to get up on these cliffs first of all, because I want to see if I can get to uh, this quest marker. It seemed that it was uh, above me uh, on these mountain tops, so hopefully I can get over there this way. Perhaps if I get up on this pipe in, perhaps that will take me up there. Am I actually in the Forbidden Zone right now? It's, t it's tough to tell when it's not lit up all red at night time. But that might be the uh, where Mobius is. If that's the case, I'm here a bit a bit too early, really. I don't want to be going there until the end of the game. Um, can I cross over here, maybe? On this pipe? Perhaps. I don't think I'm high enough, actually. Because, look, there's the tunnel there. And I want to be up there, really. If I can't get up there, we'll... Uh... Ooh, a duffel bag. Ah. Okay, so everyone since that good one that I found has been quite rubbish, which is unfortunate. I found that first one was really full of really useful stuff. Um, okay, perhaps... That's not what I want. There we go. Perhaps if I drop down here, maybe. Let's see what we got over here. If this is uh, Mobius' base, this is funny. Because I'm already here when I shouldn't be. Forbidden Zone Dome Entrance. Yeah, I should not be here right now. Ah, there's a flag painted here. Perhaps I just missed the entrance. Can I just... I can just get in here, okay. Oh, now I feel really dumb that I didn't just go in here. Please go down. I've got three shots left with this gun. Back over to my proto-axe. What have we got in here? Uh, I could do without Nuka Cola for now. Ah, here we are. This is what we were after. Uh, light switch. Nice. I'll take that. And I'll take all this duct tape as well. That's useful. I forgot that that was a component for weapon repair kits, in fact. Uh, okay. Bottle caps I'll gladly take. i turn this off. Ooh, that's a force field. Ooh. Oh, okay. What we got down here then? Interesting. Uh, Salmon, I'm going to be lurking around while I work on some network issues, but I'll be in and out. No problem, buddy. Thanks for the work. Uh, <laughs> thanks for the lurk. Sorry, I can't speak properly today. Talking's hard. But, uh, yeah, you do you, buddy. I appreciate the lurk. Thank you very much. Ooh. This looks interesting. This looks like a little treasure trove of goodies. Very nice. Uh, we'll take a carton of cigarettes. We'll sell them. Because I need the flipping money nowadays. Pulse grenade. They're useful. Nice. I can see this as well. It's a layer gun. We can uh, smash that into our Elijah variant and... Uh, repair it. So I will take that. Being as it uh, condition rapidly declines, as we found out from uh, X8. I'm wandering around there fighting uh, night, night uh, stalkers. Right, Plasma grenades as well. Very nice. Oh, well, that's cool. Little, uh, little stash down here. I'm glad I come down here. Very cool. Very cool indeed.
Okay, where's the next thing that we need to go and get? I think um, I think we'll get this at the same time as the antenna. Uh, because that's uh, one of our next quests. Um, so these both incidentally take us to the same place. So uh, I guess we'll, we know where we'll be going next. Um, before we do that though, we'll return to the sink. Um, we will uh, we'll prepare there, get ourselves, uh, get our, um, store everything we don't need to carry around with us. Um, get our carry weight in, in good condition. Um, and do, uh, install the personalities and upgrades that we found. And then, um, then I'll take a break and we'll head uh, over to get the uh, antenna then as well. Do I want to pick up these Nuka Colas? They are a useful healing item and I'm running out of food to heal with so I will take them that's fine okay right I'll uh, teleport straight over to the sink now yeah Joe what's up dude hey buddy it's good to see you happy big Wednesday I am alive I swear certainly hope so my friend let's give you a shout out real quick how are you doing buddy happy big Wednesday to you it's a nice surprise to see you my friend not gonna lie. Okay, look at me. I'm gonna like slowly turn. It's great armor. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> good clip, buddy. Good clip. How are you doing? How are you doing? Hope you're doing well. Hope you and Morgan are doing well. And uh, it's good to see you, buddy. It's good to see you. Happy Big Wednesday. Right. All right. Let's go inside the sink. I uh, haven't been to anyone's streams in like a million years, so I'm sorry. Don't worry about it, dude. Don't worry about it. If you've got stuff going on, and, and it's totally understandable. You don't have to. Uh, you don't have to show up all the time. You can. Um, you know, it's just good to see you when you when you can make it. There's no need to apologize for that, my friend. And um, especially not to me either, because I'm the worst for it. I try my best to uh, to get around and um, see people's streams myself. But with the Earth being round, and uh, honestly as well, I'm a bit rubbish at things like that. But uh, you know, it's it's fine. I totally understand. I totally understand. Uh, I just realized your beard is short. <laughs> yeah, I shaved. Um, I shaved on Sunday. Um, I've been meaning to do something with my beard for a long time because um, and it, it was wonky as AF, essentially. It was like super long on the right and it like kind of went like that. It was almost like there was a chunk missing here. And uh, it was like that for a while and it was really doing my head in. So... Sunday, I was like, right, I'm finally going to do something about this now. And then uh, I just I just went and took it all off. Because I, I was also thinking about hitting the reset, reset button for a while as well. Because that's good. It's good for your face. It's good for your beard. Um, it's good to hit the reset button on, on your beard every now and then. So I just went in and just took it all off. And um, another thing as well is that I'd actually forgotten what I look like. I'd forgotten what my face looked like. So that's, that's nice as well. It's good to remind myself what I look like, really. <laughs> or am I nuts? Uh, Joe, I'm doing okay, not too bad. Oh, that's good to hear, buddy. That's good to hear. Uh, I also haven't streamed in a million years. I've wanted to, but where we're at, the internet isn't the most stable, and I can't reasonably wire in, so it's more difficult. Oh, that, that sucks, dude. That sucks, but uh, I understand as well. Um, I um, it's, it's a nightmare, isn't it? Especially on Wi-Fi. I had to wire... Uh, up the well, my housemate ended up doing it in the end, but we had to wire up. <laughs> I bought this like gigantic Ethernet cable, and it goes like it goes from my living room, so it goes quite a way away anyway. It goes all the way around the living room, out into the hallway, across the wall, around my housemate's bedroom door, uh, around the wall down here, behind uh, where, where where I'm well, in front of me here, behind the wall there, and then through this wall. <laughs> around this corner, around the back, and plugged into the back of the PC. It was a bit of uh, it was a bit of a mad setup, so I understand. Uh, I'm also waiting till I can come back with a new with new art and stuff, and I gotta wait till I can pay Jagby for it. Yeah, I understand, dude. But um, you know, you do you, dude. You come back when you're ready as well. We would uh, all love love you and miss you, and would love to see you back, but. Also, you need to uh, you need to do what you need to do. You know, everyone understands. Uh, Joe. Oh man, I know the feeling. I've been waiting to clean shave as well, but my son has never seen me without a beard ever, so I don't want him to panic. Um, he, how old's your son? 
That's <laughs> so wild. Uh, how old's your son? He's um, he's at least a couple of years old, right? He'll be fine. He'll be fine. It'll be shock, like, temporarily. It won't take him long to adjust to it, though. You know? There's other things that he'll recognize about you, like your mannerisms and your voice and, and things like that. You know, he might be like, oh, but then you just say, oh, yeah, daddy had a haircut on his face or whatever you need to say to him. And he'll, 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 he'll be, like, over it in no time. He will. He very much will. All right, let me just uh, sort out a bit of uh, invent and stuff. Uh, we'll get into uh, we'll get into a good position. Um, plug in these uh, upgrades we found. One of them is over here, and this guy, this guy is an absolute star. Ooh, oh yeah, baby, feels good to be online again. Yeah, all oh, circuits online, ready to receive your seed. <laughs> uh, what did you just say? <laughs> You'll see, baby. I'm the original, certified, rarefied, testified GS2000 biological research station. Yes, sir. I'm a seed cloning machine. You got seeds? I'll clone the shit out of them. This guy's an absolute star. Absolute star. Uh, Joe, Jagby has given me the best friend... For 15 years discount many many times and i want to actually pay him for this next batch that's fair dude uh jude is two years old turned two on the first of this month oh happy birthday jude happy birthday to you um yeah you'll be fine you'll be fine if you shave your face clean um <laughs> you'll be fine after a, a few moments honestly um i'd like to process some plants I guess if our um, seed cloning machine were to have a personality, uh, he probably would be a bit of a ladies' man, just like this guy is. Um, so, process seed into planter. Dried block, uh, dried brock flower removed. Dried. Oh God, I've got a few. Oh, I didn't realize I picked up so many seeds. I thought I had one in my inventory. Now, um, it'll take a while. But after a while, excuse me. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Excuse me. Yeah, after a while, things will start growing here. And um, this place, this, when, when you complete this uh, uh, sink, it becomes an absolute powerhouse for producing uh, anything you might need. You've got all the food you might need here uh, by planting seeds. Um, you can make pretty much infinite repair, weapon repair kits. Uh, you've got the ammo bench here. You've got all the storage in the world. I completely forgot about this storage up here, by the way. Um, you, um, you've got other various bits and pieces that uh, will convert things into uh, resources for you um, or basic components to make things. Uh, all the storage, you've got obviously your bed to rest. Um, you'll be able to make and um, produce your own purified water in the in the sink eventually. It becomes an absolute powerhouse for producing useful stuff as you go along. So uh, let's go back over to uh, the biological research station a second. Well, hello. Still waiting for that seed. Um, what does that mean? It's the miracle of life, baby. You bring me some succulent genetic samples. And I'll work my mojo on them. Clone you up all kinds of plans. Oh, yeah. I can also break them down for you. If you're into the kinky stuff, bring me any old plant parts. And I'll grind them up into salient green for you. Yeah. You like that, don't you, baby? Uh, Joe, have you done the Overwatch event yet? Um, yeah, I have, actually. Um... Would you know it? Um, they announced it was coming out yesterday, uh, Monday. Um, so I'd already streamed Overwatch this week by then, by the time I found out. But um, I did have a quick uh, go of the new Junkenstein event uh, yesterday. Um, I think after I streamed, I was up mega, mega late last night because uh, obviously I streamed for a long time last night. Then I was in Beard's chat while I was doing some other things um, like uploads and stuff. 
And um, then I jumped on Overwatch as well. And um, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. They've mixed it up. It's not the usual Junkenstein event that they ha usually have every year. It's kind of more... Uh, it's more story orientate orientated. You can go all the new characters and Ash. They're the four heroes you can pick from. And you literally um, go through Iconwald. You go through Iconwald and each section there'll be a narrator telling you um, like story uh, bits and what you're trying to do. And there'll be bosses um, in increments and then you'll be like, you'll be like, oh, your next mission is to gather here. And when you're all gathered in the same spot, then it'll be, they'll like open the gate and then something will happen. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I enjoyed it. I only played like the basic version though, uh, where you can't fail. Then you've got the extra difficulties then after that. Um, Joe, Joe K.O. It's pretty fun. I was hoping it would show off the talent trees and stuff they originally talked about for PvE missions, but it was cool. Yeah, I get what you mean. I think though this is like they're easing into what, uh, into uh, more story based stuff uh, for the PvE that's coming out next year. I think they're just like, it's like a practice thing with, with a bit of lore that's not like you know, it's not actual canon lore, it's just a spin-off Halloween thing. But I think that's them sort of like, you know, putting out a little bit uh, as uh, a sort, sort of, not a test, I guess. But y you get what I mean, hopefully. Hopefully you understand what I mean. But uh, I get what you mean as well about the um, skill trees and stuff. I'm actually really excited to see what the PvE turns out to be. If the story's really good and the build variations are really good, I'm going to be all about that because... Um, one of, the, one of the things I love about um, action RPGs is actually build variations. Um, I'm all about that. So I'm, I'm quite hyped for that. I'm quite excited about that. But yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty good, the new event. It is pretty good. Um, right, so if I bring you samples of dried plant, dried plant life, you can clone them and grow them into these planters. You know it, baby. I just need some samples and I got you going. Take a few days, but trust me. It's all kinds of good. Mm. What's salient green? Just the miracle of life in sticky, gooey, liquid form, baby. Heat that gunk up over a campfire and just watch it congeal into all kinds of plants. Now, we have come across salient, ge uh, salient green at one point. Um, it was a way of turning... I think you could turn it into plants, right? Or... No, we, we turned it into maize. Um, so it's salient green that you could turn into um, into food, essentially. It's obviously a play on soylent green, but of course um, it is plant matter and not people uh, like it is in the movie. But uh, it is a play on so uh, soylent green. Right, I have to go now. Uh, it's been a blast talking to you, though, Biological Research Station. Hurry back with that seed now, <laughs> baby. I like him. He's cool. He's very cool. Now, um, we did get another personality as well. Um, where are they? I forget where they are. Uh, here we are. Are you the right one, though? I think we got number two. Um, so number two will be here. Mm, that was a nice little uh, cat nap. How long was I out? Um, what should we say here? So another light switch in the other room. Do you control that one too? Um, right, let's say that. I saw another light switch in the other room. Do you control that one too? Oh, her. Trust me, sweetie. You're better off not thinking about that frigid little ice queen. Yeah, these light switches, they don't get along. Um, we've only got the personality for number two right now. Uh, but it sounds like there's some bad blood between you or um, circuits. <laughs> she thinks she's so much better than everybody just because her processors are bigger. Ooh, she makes me so mad. Okay, then forget I said anything. Sure thing, sweetie. Uh, what are you? Some kind of novelty talking light switch. I was Dr. Mobius's personal assistant. We were studying, um, oh shoot, what was it? Oh yeah, lightning. No, no, wait, uh, lighting. That's right, how lighting affects human interaction. And what did you find out? Oh, it was super exciting. It turns out that some pretty colored lights can make you way better at talking to people. Can you turn those lights on for me? Oh, 
I'd love to, sweetie, but I don't have the programming. All the data from the experiments was lost. You'd have to go out into that nasty old crater and find the backup copy. Okay, so we need to find the upgrade uh, to get that. So uh, I have to go now. Bye now. Right, so we got the personality for one of the light switches. Uh, not that one, just the one. What else did we pick up? Was there anything else? Um, we got the biological research. I think that was it, right? Um, they would be a misc if they were anywhere. Uh, let's see now. I've got some stuff to sell as well, in fact. Oh, and uh, i got some coffee mugs to store. Right. Um, no, I think... See, I do have Legion Denarius. And that's interesting, though. Because, um, in, in actual fact, that makes perfect sense. Um, the, the sink is from pre-war, right? So it makes sense that they wouldn't, res uh, they wouldn't accept... Uh, legion legion currency that that's actually really really cool annoying because i would have an extra what 1276 caps but um it's still pretty cool all the same um where are we do i have any more oh oh they're book recipes that's fine i don't think i do no i don't have any I don't have any other upgrades or... Never mind. Okay. Let's um, put some stuff away before we forget. Right. I've got coffee cups to go in here. Honestly, I know I've been collecting up these coffee cups, but there is going to be a reason for it. I promise you. Uh, which we'll get to as soon as we find one of the personalities for the sink. Um, I've got a few things to sell to you as well, my good man. Um, I like to buy some things. Or i.e. sell some things. Right. Buy these cigarettes. Uh, what else did I have to sell? Was that it? Oh, buy the, those cigarettes as well. Uh, Pre-war money, that can go. And that is fine, I believe. Yeah, there we go. Uh, oh, of course, I've almost forgot. Where's my Elijah? There it is. Um, may as well smash them together now. Uh, make sure that's in perfect condition. And uh, I think, other than uh, so just some p uh, components for weapon repair kits, I think we're good. Um, where are we now? Uh, duct tape can go away. I could probably make a couple, actually. I've got 15 pre-made anyway, so it's not urgent. I'll just store the parts for now. Scrap electronics. What are these schematics? Schematics billboard. Okay. Uh, scrap metal, that can go away. Wonder glue and wrench. There we are. And uh, I think we are all good then. Basically. Um, I'll probably... I, actually, I'll probably... Oh, there's ammo as well. I'm going to break down all the stuff that we're not going to use though. Uh, break down 10 millimeter. Uh, oh, we got an achievement for that. Nice. Um, break down this 5mm. We don't need that. And also break down the 9mm as well. Did I not break down this? Oh, what did I break down? I thought I broke down all the 5mm. Hopefully I didn't break down anything valuable. And there you go, 9mm as well. Can I make anything useful? That's the that's the next question. Ammo. Um, preferably, no. I still can't. I still haven't got any large rifle prima. I would really, really be nice to be able to uh, make some 308 because I'm really running low on the good stuff now. Uh, I'm running low on microfusion cells and also 308. Um, I'm, in fact, I might even need to start using the doggo gun. The doggo gun, though, is terrible, but I might not have a choice. I might not have a choice in the future. Alright, fine. Okay. With the uh, ammo sorted now. Uh, how are my stats while I'm here? Alright, cool. I can get a free uh, top-up of H2O from the sink. I can never find the sink. Where is the sink? It's probably in the, um, the biological research place, right? 
That would make the most sense. Ah, there it is. Ah, sink. Right. Well, hello there. Can I get you a drink? Yes, please. Um, I'd just like a drink, thanks. You can have as much as you like. Just, uh, please don't put your lips on the faucet. It's so unsanitary. There we are. If I remember, that takes your H2O down 20 at a time. So I'll do two more. Well, hello there. Why, hello? If I do two more, and then that should be enough. Well, hello there. I really need the upgrade just so I can make my own uh, purified water. Um, what can we use for food? Um... Maze. Maze will do the trick, because Maze is amazing. And then uh, we'll just get a quick nap for a couple of hours. That should sort out my sleep as well. Here we are. Two hours. And... There we are. Everything hunky-dory. Uh, in fact, in fact, I'll take one more sip from the sink. And then we'll be, uh, then we'll be in good shape. Why, hello? There we go. Okay, coolio. All right. And then uh, our next destination is going to be uh, down here in X2. Uh, trying to pick up the uh, one of the technologies we've been asked to recover, which is uh, the antenna. But uh, I'm going to take a real quick break now, guys. Wow, I got carried away. <laughs> it was break time ages ago. But um, time flies when you're having fun, right? Time flies when you're having fun. Uh, don't worry, though. I won't be long, okay? Um, maybe even I'd suggest, right? i suggest that if you've been sitting around for quite some time, maybe uh, getting up and stretching your legs as well. It'll be good for you. Um, the last thing you want is thrombosis. Trust me, you do not want that shit. And uh, also, uh, blood flow is good. good for your brain. It's good for your body. It's good for everything. So um, I'm going to take five minutes, okay? Uh, but no longer than seven. And... Uh, I will be, I'll be.